Hey guys, Antrenum here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys one of the most messed up mob villages that I have ever seen spawn in Minecraft in the entire history of ever, or at least uh, since 1.8 has come out. And the reason why I'm starting from such a distance here is because at least with this glitch that I found, uh, it is best to be as far away from the village as, as you can before you go spawning it. Like, you don't want to spawn inside of the area where all of this happens. And essentially what I'm doing here is I am spawning the village for the first time ever. Because when you do this glitch, or when you, uh, when you spawn this map, at least if you download the link that's going to be in my description, Oh god, this looks like it's more messed up than it's ever been before. Oh my god. But uh, yeah, be sure to download the thing that's going to be in the description of this video. And it's going to allow you to plop this map into a server and your coordinates will be way over there. All you have to do is rename uh, a file in the players folder to correspond with your personal Minecraft name. But yeah, I mean, it is really quite something. So, okay, let's try and walk further here just to, just to get more of the village to spawn because I know it's going to spawn up a little spawn a little messed up, but I mean, I do need all of it to spawn before I can really show you guys the problems that are going on here. And by the way, this is the only mob village I have ever seen this happen with. Uh, I actually found all of this on a public multiplayer server and I ran into this village like this. Uh, it was a vanilla server and I found all of this like this. And if I hit F3, you can see that I am about 17,000 blocks out from the spawn point yes i did legitimately walk that far just because i was you know in insanely bored uh, although most of it was ocean anyways but yeah so if i go over here you can see that this this little hut right here is completely cut off but if i try and walk into it here the, all the blocks just kind of bounce around and i can destroy blocks that are around it but they still won't regenerate like you might think them to do and i can try and bounce into this and stuff and just it will not let you in. So let me try heading off to the rest of the village here. Oh yeah, and see the gar the the whole ah, let me out. This whole thing right here, which is supposed to be boarded up, uh, is supposed to be lined with wood, isn't spawning anything. And sometimes this can spawn even much worse than this. And I know that there's at least like two other gardens in this village, so I should be able to take a look. But uh, right here, the side of this house right here, which is spawning very slowly just because my server is fairly laggy. But once again, the server that I joined is actually quite a fast server um, as far as, you know, standard servers go. But uh, this little thing right here where fences are supposed to spawn, they do not spawn. So, yeah. Um, if you guys do end up checking this out, what I would personally recommend is that you do this in multiplayer because the one attempt that I did with this in single player, it spawned the village perfectly normal. But what I personally think is happening is that two mob villages are spawning on top of each other. Oh, and by the way, there is a mob spawner right underneath here. I think if I go down right about here. Yes. Okay, right about here. There's a, there's a, a nice little, yeah, mob spawning room. So that's something to consider as well, though there's really no point, but it's something that's kind of interesting. Like, you gotta wonder what these villagers were thinking. Uh, looks like it's turning nighttime here, so I should type in time set zero, or... Oh, no, okay, so that did work. There we go. So, yeah, but... Ah, oh, okay, perfect. I was really hoping this would show up like this. Look at this garden. It seems like this part generated properly, then the wood on this kind of failed. Then, like, there's just this random mixture of these tilled soils that are automatically tilling themselves, automatically planting these, but just very, very slowly. And, I mean, it's not, like, so slow that your typical server would end up operating like that normally. No, this is just not something that is supposed to be happening naturally. And then this house right here... Are, are you testificates, like... Are you that bad at building your cities? Really? Like, I, I just can't make heads or tails of it. The only thing that would absolutely convince me that there were two mob villages trying to spawn on top of each other is if there were two wells, because wells spawn um, with these at their, cent at their center points. So that's something to keep in mind with a mob village. Otherwise, I do not know what happened to this thing. Um, the roof on this is kind of messed up as well. But like I said, this is the very first mob village that I have ever seen this happen with. And I passed dozens on the on the server that I play on. Looks like even the other side of this house right here is kind of messed up. Oh, and then we got some more of this right here that's all covered up, which is just trippy. So what I'm going to do next before I go ending off the video is I am going to go off into the distance. And then in the, the, map, the map folder, I am going to delete the map file for what has just spawned. And I am going to allow it to spawn one more time uh, just to see if anything different happens, to see if there's any sort of different occurrences. So now that it's off in the distance and now it's, uh, you know, unrendering there. So completely unrendered, I am going to disconnect from the server, and when I come back, uh, that part of the map, or at least this entire part of the map, is not going to be generated. So you're going to notice it's going to generate very slow again, and uh, we'll see what happens, and then, yeah. So let me go ahead and let me switch out all of that stuff with the map files. 
So now that I've got all that switched out here, I am going to join the server for the first time since doing that. And you can see uh, the land itself is spawning really quite slowly. And like I said before, that's because this is all newly generated terrain. Uh, this is very similar as to what would happen when you join a multiplayer server for the first time it is, if it's fairly slow. Uh, like I said, this is just my personal server. So yeah, it's, you know, for the most part, fairly slow because it's my personal computer and it's going, you know, it's processing a lot of data. But yeah, so now that we, I've gone over here a little bit faster just to see if anything else would happen. And you can see the corner of this house is just total banana hammock. It's just totally bananas. Uh, yeah, that's the only way that I can really describe it. Um, the side of this house is all messed up. I think that's for the second time that's messed up. Uh, let's try and head in here. Doesn't look like there's anything messed up in that testificate's house. Um... Yeah, this is even mess more messed up than it was before. This house once again is cut off. So it seems like actually a lot of this a lot of the same issues are happening, but like I said before, I noticed that on single player this didn't happen. So just something to keep in mind if you're going to be messing with this uh this glitch. So, uh, just don't do it in single player. Make a multiplayer server. Um, you can get the exe file off of Minecraft.net. Plop this in there, and then go into the go into that folder. Go into your players folder, and then rename that. It's gonna say username here or something along that line. I'm gonna rename it. Uh, just make that your username .dat so it'll spawn you out on that hill over here and you can walk to this mob village and see for yourself. But anyways guys, that's pretty much everything that I wanted to show off in this video. Uh, I found this and I thought it was completely and totally balls to the wall random. Um, and, if, and if you find this weird, be sure to share it with your friends as well because I think it's a glitch that would be interesting to try out. Um, like, you know, with multiple people on sort of like a large scale because... Like I said, I've never seen this happen with a mob village before, ever, you know? It's just, it completely is boggling my mind. And you notice with that one chunk right there, like you'd think maybe the house would cut off because I was right there or something. It doesn't, it, you know, it's just the most random things. Oh, and even now over here, this fence is now generated in. Um, I'm not sure what parts of this will generate properly and what parts won't. I think like if a whole grass block generates right there, then it won't generate properly. But I can tell you right now, this is not a result of my server being too slow to generate this stuff because obviously it's able to generate all of this terrain, you know, just fine. So yeah, um, anyways guys, I hope you all have enjoyed this particular video. My name is Aminem and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching. I wish testificates still had the little sign above their head so that they were a lot easier to make fun of. But I mean, why are they in straight jackets? Really? Ugh, despicable.